Hi guys, welcome back to another one of these guys video. Peter here. I have a 2015 Mocha fault code P0617 and up on the instrument cluster we have a code 89. Okay, P0617 cylinder one glow plug. So we're going to go and do a little bit of testing on the glow plug. One second. What I'm going to use, one of my followers actually said it, what he uses is a test light. So I'm going from battery negative, sorry, my on route. I'm going from battery positive, I need to get myself confused, over and on to, I'll just go to fuel rail to make sure the light is working, okay? Now, back on to number one glow plug, try and get it all in shot there if I can. You can see when I get onto number one glow plug, the test light lights, lights very well. It's on the top or the tip of the glow plug at this point in time, okay? I'm gonna go over, I'm gonna go on to number four. As I was questioning was, Cylinder one, the time belt side or gearbox side. When I touch off the glow plug here on cylinder number four, you can see that my bulb lights again, okay? So cylinder number one is testing good with a test light. Now what we have, it's hard to see this, or at least a little bit, right? The stylus got snagged. It's gonna be a little bit hard to see this because of the glare and uh, using an ohm meter this time. You can see, as I said there, it's hard to see, but with zero ohms resistance. So I'm going to get my test leads when I find them. Okay, so graphing multimeter. On this occasion, we're going from battery ground and we're going to go to the glow plug. So I'm going to go to battery ground now. So I'm just going to verify. Right, and we have minus one ohm resistance because I didn't actually, it's very hard to see guys, sorry. Because I didn't zero my meter, but when I go over, I'm gonna go on to glow plug number four down here. Maybe you'll be able to see it better than me. All right, I'm on glow plug number four. I don't know if you can see that, it's hard to see, I can get that. It's two ohms of resistance. I'm gonna come back over and on to glow plug number one. If you can see me right on the top of it. In glow plug number one, I have 34 ohms. Of resistance again very hard to see sorry about the glare but you can see it there 34 four ohms of resistance 32 it dropped it there now guys the only real reason for this was just to point out the difference between the test light and the actual multimeter okay it's it's sometimes the test light which is a good test may not be comprehensive enough and if you have a you use a test light it tests good or at least it looks good and then you do along and you go oh, them glow plugs are fine and you Still have this fault code and you're like, oh, what's going on? It, you use multimeter, okay? And it just pinpoints and shows the, the resistance or the difference in the resistance. Shorted, but not totally burnt out, okay? Please, please like and subscribe if any of my hints and tips are good to you. And I'll talk to you in the next cartoon. Thanks, Peter, signing out.